in an alloy zinc and copper are in the ratio 1 is to 2 in the second alloy the same elements are in the ratio 2 is to 3 if these two alloys be mixed to form a new alloy in which two elements are in the ratio 5 is to 8 the ratio of these two alloys in the new alloy is so we have alloys zinc and copper are in first alloy is in the ratio 1 is to 2 and in the second alloy it is in the ratio 2 is to 3 after mixing these two alloys a new alloy is formed and in which zinc and copper are in the ratio 5 is to 8 but we need to find out the ratio in which these two alloys mix it to form this third alloy so here 1 plus 2 is equal to 3 parts 2 plus 3 is equal to 5 parts 5 plus 8 is equal to 13 parts total parts of all these three ratios are different so we need to equalize these the total parts of these three ratios to equalize it multiply 1 is to 2 with 5 into 13 multiply 2 is to 3 with 3 into 13 multiply 5 is to 8 with 3 into 5 after equalizing now you have equalized it after equalizing sink part in these three ratios are 13 into 5 is equal to 65 65 into 1 is equal to 65 13 into 3 is equal to 39 39 into 2 is equal to 78 3 into 5 15 15 into 5 is equal to 74 5 so after equalizing the total parts sink in first ratio is 65 parts Second ratio is 78 parts. Sing in third alloy, that is a mixture alloy is new alloy is 75 parts. So that means first alloy sink part is equal to 65. Second alloy sink part is equal to 78. After mix, mixing first and second alloy, sink part will become 75. That means by allegation method, 75 minus 65 is equal to 10. 78 minus 75 is equal to 3. So your answer is 3 is to 10. Option A is your answer.